Lawrence is dropping me off at the car at 5.45 in the morning because I'm leaving to St. Bart's. Going for Fia's swim just for a day. I mean, three days, but one day of work. So I'm just flying by myself and I kind of hate it. But it's gonna be fun. I'm going with Kelly and I'm gonna miss you. Made it to the airport. I just went through security and there were these dogs. And I don't know why, but it always makes me a little nervous. Like, I obviously have nothing to hide, but still, anyone else out there has the same? Let me know. I think I'm a little early, so I'm gonna go to the lounge, have a tea, chill a little bit. I think I'm on the same flight as Kelly. We're shooting swim as well, so that'll be fun. I'm gonna try to sleep a little bit because I slept so little last night. And I'm gonna continue watching the series I'm watching on Netflix now. Fist of Fist. It's really, really nice. Anyone else has seen it? Oh my god, so I'm on the plane. My friend just told me about these water bottles. It's called the Sani. It's insane what I found. I never knew. I would always drink them on the plane. I'm gonna put a little link here where you can see about it. But it's so bad. I don't know what to drink now on the plane. Best plane to fly on. No, they're not. My mom's a pilot. She told me. You want you want to have this debate <laughs> with my pilot right now? Let's have it. The small ones are like the, the, the least little safe afraid. ones. Your mom's a pilot. Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. They're the least safe ones, right? Yeah. yeah. And then Simbards is the least safe, safe airport to, to, to land. Because land. No. Yeah. Yeah. The, the landing strip Don't is so short. Don't freak out before we go. This is the plane. It's so tiny. We're a little afraid. There's also no co-pilot. So I made it to the room. Love this place. Hi, I have here this outdoor patio. This is for the mosquitoes because there are a lot of mosquitoes. Here's the bathroom and the bathtub. I don't know what it is, even when it's like a short flight because it was only three and a half hours. I always feel like drained, like tired after a flight. Like I'm packing my huge luggage. No, super tiny. I think I'm gonna have a quick lunch with Kelly because it's 4.30 right now and we didn't really have a normal lunch. Oh my god, how cute is this robe? Just got it in the mail from Victoria's Secret and Love and Lemons and I think it has a little like thing that you put around it. Pretty see-through but maybe over a bikini or something. Or at night with some nice heels. I bought these ones, like the low ones, so it's more comfortable. And then, oh yeah, I also brought this. It's like a golden milk blend because I'm trying to drink a little less caffeine. And this is like a mix of organic turmeric powder, organic cinnamon powder, organic ground ginger, and organic ground black pepper. So it's like anti-inflammatory. Very nice. I might ask them to take make me some now with some almond milk if they have because I feel a little bloated and it's not surprising because I flew from Tokyo to Amsterdam, Amsterdam, New York and New York here in one week. Whenever I feel like that I don't really like it when I have a swim shoot because on those kind of days when you're walking around in bikini all day I'm always a little self-aware. It's totally normal of course but you just want to feel good and then I have a little lymphatic drainage massage later and then I'm gonna have a good night of sleep. So pretty here. I wish Lawrence was here so we could watch the sunset and be super romantic. I'm going to my room and I think gonna get a quick shower and then gonna watch my series for a little bit and then at seven I have a massage in the room so it's gonna be very nice 
and then after I hope I'm like super tired from the massage I'm gonna fall asleep so maybe I'll take a shower now and then tomorrow morning we're starting at 6 30 maybe when I wake up very early I'll do a little workout but otherwise I'll rest you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna ask if they have some Epsom salt and take a bath I also want to ask you guys what do you think should I cut my hair because it's so long you see <laughs> it's like super super long hello no because I'm gonna go to bed early all right okay thank you so it was the reception that the team of yes they already shot today as if I wanted to do sushi dinner and I really want to but I'm very exhausted if I want to be fresh on set tomorrow, I think I should go to bed early. Uh, and then I'll do dinner with the team tomorrow after my shoot. Where were we talking about? Oh, about the hair. Yeah, it's so long and it's also a little bit dark. In this light, it actually looks a little lighter, but as you can see, it's pretty dark. But then when I saw old photos of myself with the very light hair, I didn't really like it. I mean, not bad, but I like this better maybe. I'll put a photo here. Let me know what you guys think. I've been a little bit more sensitive. I don't know why, but I used to be that person that could put anything on my face. I could like remove my makeup with hand soap and put face cream from like one dollar, whatever. And my skin would be fine with it. But lately it's been, I don't know, sensitive. I also had an allergic reaction because I got the frozen, uh, the derma roller on Amazon that I showed you guys in the vlog in LA that you put in the fridge and I rolled my face with it in the morning and I think there came some jelly stuff came from it and it came on my face and the next day my whole face had an allergic reaction and I never had it before. I was so shocked. I was like, what is happening? So I would not recommend that roller ever since my skin gets inflamed sometimes. I don't know if you can see it, but even now it's more than red than it usually is. Maybe I should take it down on the facial sculpting tools a little bit. Maybe I'm a little too rough. So unfortunately they don't have the Epsom salt. So then I'm not sure if I wanna take a bath. I might take a quick shower. I'm gonna wait for my massage. Good morning. 6.30, we're on our way to the villa. I slept pretty good. I was up from 3 till 4.30, but then I fell back asleep. And I fell asleep at 8.30, so that's good. I'm gonna drink some coffee and then I'll be right back because I'm a little too tired now. So we always start our day with a fitting. With Ilona. Hi. And we're trying out all the outfits for the whole day, making sure they fit all right. And then we're going to hair makeup. Vamos! Because we're heading out to the beach. I think it's 9 a.m. only. Look how pretty it is here. Okay, Howard. It's our producer. He's always like on the time. He's like, let's go, let's go, let's go. Pretty hot out. I'll probably get sunburned because I haven't seen the sun in a little bit. Today I'm shooting with Lorena, Hey, Kelly, and Jerome. What is this one? I don't know. First shot of today. So nice to be in the sun. I really like their new bikinis. I'm excited for them to be in store. I'm posing that much. Lunchtime. 
day. Oh, Three thirty-two. Yeah. So we might order a coffee. Come up here. You gotta go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, done shooting. The last shot was like a shower shot, so I had to go in the shower till my hair was all wet. So I just dried it quickly and I want a little bit of a wave in my hair, so I always put it up in two knots. So hopefully, that's gonna come out nice. And we're gonna have some dinner, and Taylor is still here, so she's gonna come. Kelly's gonna come, Lorena is gonna come, and then the whole VS crew. I'm very excited and we're going to this really really nice restaurant with like a very nice view and very good seafood so I'm excited for that. This is my favorite lip liner. I don't overline a lot, I just put a little bit on the top. It's the Marc Jacobs one in the color Nude. And then I bought this one in Tokyo. I think it's from Paul and Joe. I thought it was a clothing brand actually but they have makeup too. I can't really do anything else because most of the makeup from the shoot went off under the shower. And this is gonna be it. Okay, I'm gonna change quickly and then I'll show you guys what I'm gonna wear. Okay, so first I'm putting this cute little top from For Love and Lemons and Victoria's Secret. And then I have these pants from Monday Swimwear that has a matching top. It's like top and bottom. And finally, I have some pants that are long enough. All right, here we go. And I'll bring my little bag. Good morning. I'm very, very tired. We had dinner last night with the team. And I got very late. Then I got home, so I had to take the makeup off and everything. So I think I was in bed by one. Now it's 6.45. Because our pickup is at 7.45. First from St. Bart, you always take a little plane. That you take to St. Martin, the scary plane. And then there you take your regular flight to New York. But our first flight from St. Bart's is at 8 in the morning because there's only one flight out. But then the second flight to New York is at 3 p.m. So we're gonna have to wait for so many hours at St. Martin. So I'm not very excited. Martin because we have to kill five hours before our flight. So we're at this place where you can see the planes coming over the beach. Since it's noon already, the mayonnaise. and we have to wait so long for the next flight, why not have a second breakfast? <laughs> Hey guys, I made it back in New York. Excited to see Lawrence again, even if it's only for a day.